In my own research, I really learn from people in other fields in various locations from around the world, and I think that type of intellectual sharing is just really, really critical and it leads to lots of exciting advances. Multiple decades ago, it was more important that your intellectual peers maybe be in the same physical location. Now I can do very, very effective collaborations with people all over the world at very, very low cost. And so my effective number of peers uh, really has grown substantially. In my capacity as a director of the Becker Friedman Institute, we hold a lot of conferences. The advantage of those conferences is not so much that people are giving papers, it's that you're bringing people from around the world together with, overall, with overlapping interests and they're engaging in conversations. Spontaneous interactions from a variety of people are just very, very important. And the more opportunities there are, I think, that for this to kind of nurture this kind of uh, interactions across you know, locations, disciplines, and the like, and, and, and to, in, I mean, conversation, I think, is just really essential for any field advancing. Part of what it takes to be a good researcher is energy, effort, and passion to make it happen. Yes, you need to have some creativity, but you also need to be able to put serious effort into it. Look for things that really excite you. Look for things that can really ignite your passion. And choosing research areas that you really feel passion for, I think, is critical.